Now, from KPRC Channel 2 Sports, it's Friday Football Frenzy, presented by UT Physicians, your home team for health care. Hi, we're the Atascocito RC cheerleaders, and you're watching Friday Football Frenzy on Channel 2. All right, thank you, ladies. Welcome to the Friday Football Frenzy, everybody. We're live from Turner Stadium here in Humboldt, Houston's high school football show off and running. I mean, we've got you covered. Crews all over the city of Houston. You know the drill. We've got bands. We've got uh, dance teams. We've got cheerleaders. We've got it all. And, of course, what this show's all about, we've got highlights. Highlights from all over the area. Let's start it with our game of the week right here at Turner Stadium tonight. Quite the game. Atascocita, Kingwood. Everybody in gold tonight. Uh, what a what an opening night here for gold fight and win night here helping to fight childhood cancer really a cool event pick it up early the first second drive a task seat on the move Bryce Matthews to A.J. Bob, 7-0 Eagles on top of this one now. Atascocita next series. Look out again. Bryce Matthews airmails wide open to A.J. Bob, 74 yards, 4 yards to the house. Are you kidding me? 14-0 Eagles. Kingwood now responds next drive when Grant Wall finds Jack Dugas on the cross route. Stangs down 14-7, 4 minutes still left in the first. End of the quarter, it's Bryce Matthews again. What a game he had tonight. Gets loose. You see what he does with a football. 34 yards, takes it home, made it 21-7. 42-10 at the half at Tascacita, and they get the win over Kingwood tonight, 70-10. to I caught up with the Eagles a few minutes ago. All right, what a win tonight. The Eagles are pretty fired up, right? Yeah! yeah. Bryce Matthews, the quarterback. I lost track of how many touchdowns you had tonight, but what a great game you had. But I know you're the kind of guy you're going to give credit to the guys up front, yes, the whole team, right? Yes, sir. All credit goes to my offense. Uh, appreciate y'all. It's all for y'all. What's this mean? A pretty good rivalry here with Kingwood. Always good to, to beat these guys. I know that means a lot on a night where also you guys are supporting pediatric cancer. So with a lot of gold in the stands tonight. Yes, sir. Uh, it's bigger than us. Uh, it's more than just a game. It's something for everybody. And just to see them watch us play is great. All right, very good. Second win of the year. You guys fired up for the rest of the season? Yeah. All right, let's go to Galena Park ISD Stadium. Battle of the Mustangs, North Shore and Westfield. First quarter, Demetrius Davis gets the snap, and then he takes off. It's a foot race, and he's going to win easily. 40 yards to the house. Game tied at 7. Westfield answers. Cardell Williams dumps it off. Jadon Tucker, see you later. Races down the sideline. Goodbye. North Shore ends up winning this one. What a game tonight. 24-21. They improved to 2-1 and one on the year for the defending state champs. All right, now, we got Klein Collins, Klein Forest over at Klein Memorial, where not everyone was ready for some football. The dad holding the kid, he had to get a little sleep right there. Klein Collins and Forrest, the Eagles on the move in the first when quarterback Miles Rhodes fumbles. Ball's picked up by Jacob Allison. He's gone. 75-yard fumble return puts the Tigers up 7-0 in the first. Later in the quarter now, Collins with the ball, running back Braylon Bridges takes the pitch on the left side, finds that seam. Goodbye. Long touchdown right there. Klein Collins is a winner tonight. 49-21 the final. All right, over to Pridgen Stadium now. Cy Wood and Tom Ball Memorial. Woods up 21-14 at the half. But Memorial strikes first in the third. Colton Marwell with the screen to Logan Kyle. Breaks the tackle 24 yards out. We are tied at 21 apiece. Later in the third, Memorial driving again, but this time Marwell is picked off by Cy Woods' Reagan Simmons. He's going the other way. 43 yards. Put Cy Woods back on top, and they hold on for a three-point win tonight. 31-28 the final. Let's keep it moving now. Del Mar Stadium. Good look at the Harvest Full Moon tonight over Del Mar. Nice look. Lamar and Beaumont Westbrook. Third quarter, Westbrook's Troy Yeoman connects with Jordan Babino. He takes it in. Bruins leading 29-21. Back comes Lamar. Troy Tisdale forced out of the pocket. Throws across the middle to Kavion Griffin. And guess what he does? He scores. Westbrook, though, is a winner. 36-34 to final now in a shootout at Del Mar. Let's take you back south now. Winston Stadium in Friendswood. The Mustangs and the Bulldogs from LaPorte. First quarter, LaPorte leading 3-0. Luke Griden scrambles and finds Matthew Kopvich for the touchdown. 7-3 Mustangs on top. And here come the dogs. River Thompson looking for Elijah George. George has it. Nice grab for the go-ahead touchdown. And LaPorte takes a lead 
10-7, but it wouldn't last. Friendswood, that offense adds a couple of TDs. They win it tonight, 29-17, the final in that one. All right, time for a break. Catch your breath here on the Friday Football Frenzy. We're just getting warmed up. As we go to the break, the Kingwood Phillies take us out. And now it's time for the Friday Football Frenzy Play of the Game. Brought to you by Freddy's Frozen Custard and Steak Burgers. All right, welcome back to the Frenzy. Our Freddy's Frozen Custard Steak Burgers Play of the Night. North Shore's Demetrius Davis. One look. Goodbye, Mr. Davis taking it to the house. 42 yards rushing on that TD. No one had a chance. Remember now to bring your student ID to any Freddy's now through Sunday. And guess what? You get a free frozen custard. Not too bad. All right, here we go. The KD Tigers hosting a team from Mexico for the second straight season tonight. Tigers already up 7-0 when big Ron Hoff took it in from 18 yards out. Took a few players along the way with him. 14-0 Tigers. Then Bronson McClellan looking to throw. Finds Matthew Heichel across the middle. He does the rest. 52-yard TD. KD up 65-0. It's almost over out in KD tonight. All right, more highlights. Let's touch back to the studio. Check in with Arlie Alexander. He's got more. All right, take it away. Hey, Randy, we've got some great week two tilts as we take you all around. Top games, both public and private. Let's get right into it. Spring Lions taking on Fort Bend Travis at Mercer Stadium and spring up by seven when quarterback Alden Bradley keeps it in for a Lions touchdown. Lines up 14-0. Still 10 minutes left in the half and plenty of time for the Tigers to get one in. Short TD cuts at 14-7. Tigers, though, would come back and win. Fort Bend Travis 53 spring 49 over to Falcon Stadium visiting St. Thomas faithful fired up it's real dark out there for those sunglasses get on the board here where Maddox cop finds Cameron Bonner wide open 42 yard score and much of the dismay of former Texans tight end Owen Daniels Kincaid assistant coach there Falcons defense would show up cops pass picked off by Keller Horlock but St. Thomas way too much they win 27 10 Cinco Ranch at the rig taking on Pearland alma mater of Megan the Stallion and in the first it's Brandon Campbell breaking tackles and look at this no one can take him down because he's a big old freak seven nothing Pearland after that score and the Oiler offense back on the field time to make it hot JD head going deep for Cedric Mitchell defense is going to pull up late 14 nothing Pearland they got that fever for winning final four 45 to nothing. Pearland rolls. All right, Randy. Look at all those fans out there. They love that Pearland win. <laughs> hey, Ari, thanks. Got a couple of friends here. Three of them, in fact, the Kingwood football ball boys hanging out with us on the F Friday football frenzy. Good job tonight, guys. Hey, we've got the new poll that is out voting for next week's game of the week on the Friday football frenzy. Here it is. Some great matchups. Manville Marshall, Washington and Yates, the Woodlands College Park, Klein Kane and Klein High School. Good matchup. Start voting. Click to Houston.com. Go to the Frenzy page, sports page. Vote until Tuesday. Time for another break here on the Friday Football Frenzy. The Dickinson Band takes us out. We're coming right back. All right, thank you, ladies. Last stop, Rosenberg for Terry and Lamar Consolidated. Big rivalry. Lamar Consolidated up 7-0. Uh, make it 14-0. Tay McWilliams punch it in for the 9. Terry found Pater, though, through the air when Brandon Kyles floats one up to Brandon Montebello. They close it to 14-7, but the Mustangs are up big late in this game. They're going to get the W, 56-28 right now. All right, that's going to do it for another edition of the Friday Football Frenzy. What a great night out here at Turner Stadium in Humble, celebrating gold fight win in a pediatric cancer. A great turnout by all the fans. For the entire crew at the station and out here at Turner Stadium, thanks for watching. We'll see you next Friday night on the Frenzy.